Now, abdominal pain and shock is there, immediate laparotomy is not required for. What is your answer? Huh? Hemorrhagic pantreatitis. Any other alternative answer? Liver hemangioma. You thought, no? I need to check. Actually, it was almost 6 o'clock in the morning. I had been trailing. Ah, about to fall down because I need to once more come running for the session at 10 o'clock. Eh? Hardly with one hour sleep. Eh? But hemangioma, I will tell you one reference. Hemangioma, whenever it ruptures, patient will be in such a hemodynamically unstable condition that he won't be fit for laboratory. He will not be fit for laparotomy. So that is the reason uh, we conservatively manage a patient without doing laparotomy in hemangioma is one difference. Don't be angry on me. Uh, we will check that. Huh? Put in uh, teacher is uncertain. Huh? Then uh, acute diverticulitis, what is incorrect about it? Uh, conservative treatment uh, is not right, right? Very good. So, D is the correct answer. So, you can divide it into mild diverticulitis, pelvic or distant intra abdominal abscess is called level 2, generalized purulent peritonitis is 3, and fecal peritonitis is 4. So, the rule is stage 3 and 4, urgent surgical exploration is what is basically required. But if it is only stage 1, then antibiotic therapy is agreeable. Lower esophageal sphincter is relaxed by prostaglandin E2. What will F2 will be doing? What is your alternative answer? I am thinking F2. I may not be right. I did not do much homework. F2 is a possibility. It looks uh, uh, evidently appearing, but uh, I need to recheck this answer. Melanoma, favorite question. What is your answer? Lentigo, maligna, melanoma. The best prognosis, superficial spreading, most common type, nodular is poorest prognosis. Like uh, superbatham, you must read it every day. Melanoma. Fourniers, gangrene. What is your answer? Obvious causes? Earlier they used to think idiopathic gangrene, sir. Concepts changed. Obvious cause is evident a lot of times. So, what is your alternative answer? What is your alternative answer? Make a guess. Everybody answered uh, obvious cause is evident. Eh? Oh my God, you will be unhappy if I give an alternative answer. Question number 188, lifeline. Swati Pranita proposed C, but um, Dr. Um, Sri proposes A. A is, ornier is well known. What is the common organism involved, Doctor? Wound cultures from fornier gangrene will show polymicrobial infection. E. coli is the predominant aerobe. Bacteroides is the predominant anaerobe. Other causes are Staphylococcus, Enterococcus, aerobic and anaerobic Streptococcus. But what is he being given here? Hemolytic Streptococcus associated with other organisms. That means polymicrobial. But continuing the charcha about it, Majority of the cases, it is a mixed infection and uh, although originally described as idiopathic, Fournier has an identifiable cause in 75 to 95 percent of cases. Isli A, try to get seat within one to two years. Why? Because if you finished MBBS five years back, every textbook will start saying, Although it was thought indirect hernia comes from the inguinal canal, nowadays it is being thought like this. <laughs> then you will be thinking, all that the concepts that I know, although they were thought like that, then something else is there. 
you we need to cry eh? so we need to get seed faster considering this although we thought eh, although originally described i am thinking the i am not sure eh? now uh, yeah last 10 questions disproportionate facial growth geneva convention of appg all of the above there is no second part then diploid lesion ab malformation in the stomach commonest deformity ha huh? equino virus eh? i just need to check this uh, dr maheshwar reddy lucky reddy is uh, uh, not uh, available for commenting on this and i didn't have time to do story on that now uh, osteoid histologically tumor osteoid where do you find ha huh? osteo sarcoma very good so bone or osteoid directly by the tumor cells at least somewhere in the tumor is the absolute requirement for you to diagnose uh, osteogenic sarcoma swanneck deformity easiest question rheumatoid arthritis pth does not lead to our favorite question many times it doesn't lead to phosphaturia it leads to phosphaturia so it does not lead to increased absorption of phosphates loses jones sir classical of osteomalacia and osteomalacia or rickets uh osteomalacia and also rickets maybe examiner forgot uh, thought of putting osteoporosis suddenly he got a call that patient is uh, require intubation and he left it. by the time he came malaysia remained malaysia huh? so i think uh, you can add it in the what controversies a and b can be equal contenders agree then caries sicca tuber clausis of shoulder next uh, appg may what is the question which is going to come spina ventosa after that what will come pyogenic meninge uh, pyogenic versus tubercular uh, spine involvement may difference which involves intervertebral disc then uh, which is not a external fixator beautiful question what is your answer illi zero you all know you want answer it is an external fixator only madam put it in 50 50 and uh, we can't say topper will have that mutant genes in the brain no so he will smell noel spins ah i have seen that radiograph and it is internally put not externally and he may answer huh? so noel spins joshi shanj they are all external then uh, spondylolysis the other day we had a discussion on rugger jersey fight on rugger jersey so what is your answer pars inter articularis defect is basically the problem in them yeah so dr sri is saying them um, will next day ppg will be there or not this day ppg is real or not we are not sure so remember doctor they are called mature defense mechanisms in psychiatric if you answer the paper poorly think ah this just a mock test actual exam was a need pg if you answer very well supreme court is about to give judgment finally mature defense mechanisms of psychiatry must help you to live happily that's more important ha eh? so fast intraarticularis very good ha thomas splint what thomas did for first ha huh? dia for immobilization of his wife from going around here and there while he is while <laughs> he has gone to hospital ha huh? what is the purpose of thomas splint doctor immobilization for the treatment of tb of the knee joint historical question chalo then uh, intertrochanteric fracture non union is more common malunion is more common 
what is your answer huh? ah, so what is your answer old age it is common if you do open reduction interval fixation quick mobilization is encouraged it can also be managed conservatively in the people who are debilitated older people mal union is more common than non union non union is more common where fracture neck of femur because here vascularity is very well retained so that brings us to this uh, parade of questions doctor finally the scoreboard please don't worry on the scores eh? just for a uh, what is it called betting the diagnosis we say no saddest place in the hospital to bet the diagnosis is neurology is it going to be uh, spino cerebellar ataxia type 1 or type 2 if you bet what is the use for the patient ultimately there is no use except you will celebrate a party so what is your answer doctor what what is the 36 sir huh 36 or 50 50 doctor apna luck ka pariksha karo ha ah. 4 or 25 75 so wo bhi thing that uh, uh, goes uh, wrong so kitna 40 40 questions are pardonable 160 questions are achievable pray the god huh? so thanks once more for a patient participation our online students and also all of you you had the courage to face the discussion that's most important eh? because uh, exam is over ideally we need to celebrate now the time for celebration eh? so after you get uh, good rank don't forget the old teacher come with uh, fuller ready sweets and uh, with jalebi and say that you made it if you didn't get don't worry we will be perennially preparing for the exam after this there is aims after that there is a pga after that there is a marriage after that there is a child so life is all about dreaming uh, instead of thinking this is the end point right thank you doctor So we will host this uh, discussion on the YouTube, just tell your friends to catch up on the YouTube. Huh?